Hey YouTube, what's going on? Y'all, it's your girl Raquel, aka Little Cute Nurse, and I'm back oh, with another video, y'all. I got my Boxy Charm boxes, y'all. These are from December. I won't get nobody confused. These are my December boxes. I asked you guys, did you want me to open them? A lot of people was like, yeah, girl, let us see. So, we're going to unbox these boxes on camera. And I also got whatever it is in here that I ordered from the pop-up for the month of December. So, now y'all, I don't know which one of these boxes is Lux and which one is not. So, this is the lightest one. So, we're going to open this one first. Let me get it open. And see what the story is. I opened the pop-up last y'all. Premium. This is premium. Can you believe it? It's the lightest. I really do miss getting my uh, boxy charm regular box when, when uh, the looks come out. I do miss it. And of course, I know all y'all know it's bubbles and glitz. I don't know because I haven't seen any videos, any unboxings. I don't know what's going on here. But it's so light. I'm kind of careful. The biggest thing I see, oh, it's Elemis. I got Elemis Pro Collagen. I, I. I revive mask. This is a big mask. The future of eye core is here. Care. Eye care is here. <laughs> future innovative cloud light gel formula. This serum infused eye mask is clinically proven to minimize the appearance of wrinkles. Okay, well, I need you. But this is huge. If this eye mask is big as this box, this is the biggest eye mask I have. And it is. It's huge. Okay. Yeah, that's going to last a while, a good long while. That's what it looks like. But I have a couple already open, so I won't open it, y'all. I'm going to put it in my skincare box. That's cool. That's cool. And it says this thing is $82. I might go ahead and open this because it just might do what it says it's going to do. <laughs> just saying. Just saying. Okay, all right. This box is really light. What is this? Okay. I don't know. What is this? Oh, a cuticle oil. Okay, the lifestyles. And it's kind of spilling out. Y'all see it on my hand? Yeah, I ain't got to open it. But I, I don't have a cuticle oil, so I, I ain't mad about it. In a $35 box. Yeah, I'm sneaking and using it real fast right now. You know my hands be on the ashy side. Okay, it's easy to use. I'm cool with that. Okay. How much is this cuticle oil? I didn't expect to see it in a premium box, but uh, the Lifestyle Company, the natural healing cuticle oil is made with pure almond and jojoba oil to soften and nourish the cuticles. Okay. All right. That's just what it says. I, I can get with that, I guess. Uh, it says it's $22. I wouldn't pay $22 for this, you know, but that's what it is. I'm going to definitely use it. Let's see. The next thing I have here is it's so big. It's so big. oh, <laughs> it's a volumizing mascara. It's so big. How much is this? And who made this with this name? It sounds like something from Too Faced, right? Um, what does it say? Uh, crown. All eyes on you. Oh no, that ain't it. Oh, I got a brush set in. Y'all, I'm reading all out the... I don't see this on here. Oh, yes, it is. Elizabeth Mott. It's so big, volumizing mascara. The volumizing mascara of your dreams. This Mega Volume Lash Mascara Mask lasts all day. I ain't going to read all that. I'm going to stop. Let's see how big it is. Oh, it's pretty big. That's what it looks like. Y'all ain't going to open it because I got too many mascaras open. So I'm going to put this over here in my too much makeup unopened stuff. Okay. Let me get away with that one. I got a lot of mascaras open. At least eight. Um, I guess this is what I was reading. The Crown uh, All Eyes on You 5 Piece Brush Set. It says it's a 5 piece set. and provides all necessary tools for application of eye makeup. Okay, I, 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 I see crown brushes. So, and y'all, brushes are something I can never have enough of. 
I am a brush lover. That's what we have. So I'm content with that. Now that's a big old blending brush. That sucker there that is fat. It's gonna have to get broke in. And uh, this part here, the handle is plastic. I don't have any plastic. Yeah, that's gonna work. All right, so we get one, two, three, four, five. I'm happy with that. Thank you. I ain't mad at that. And how much are those brushes? Those brushes are thirty-four dollars. That Elizabeth my mascara was twenty dollars. And the last thing is that it? Oh no! The next thing I have in here is my Kosas. It's a Kosas ten-second eyeshadow, a clean white base, fast dry, crease-resistant formula for building high-impact color that stays all day. What color is this? Hmm. It says copper halo. I didn't know they made eyeshadows. Let's see what it looked like. Oh, it looked like liquid. Can y'all see that? It's real liquidy in there. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, that's a pretty color. I'm going to have to try that. I'm going to have to try that. Just one day. with If y'all see this shade, y'all going to know. With just some uh, bronzer and then put this on the lid. I think that's going to be pretty. Oh, it feels real soft, too. It just blended right into my hand. Okay. I ain't mad at that. Just put that over there on my mushy side. And that Kosas 10 Second Eyeshadow was $28. And the last thing I have here is the Viseart palette or Visart, 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 whatever, however you want to say it. And it's $80. I have one of these that I bought when they first came out. And they were so dry. I never bought another one. And I don't even use it. I still got it because it was $80. And ooh, this is a nice natural nude palette. All nude. This says, what is this palette? All time best selling pastel. Oh, best selling palette. Y'all, I don't have my glasses on my contacts. I can't be seen. Y'all know I can't see the good without my readers. A true artist staple. Which one is this? Viseart Neutral Matte. So it is just what it looks like. That's how it looks. Okay. I got the Natasha Nanoma. Oh, these are soft. These are not like the first one. Okay. I ain't getting a lot of color payoff. Oh, that one there. That orange did. But they just no shadows. So I'm, I'm cool with that. And it's an $80 palette. So Viseart, hello. Uh huh. I'm good. I'm good. This will be my next everyday palette. I like the browns and the tones in there. The brown tones in there. Okay. That's it for the the uh, premium box. I ain't mad at it. So let's move on to the Lux box and see what we got. If y'all don't know, or for everybody who don't know, or who haven't tried box of charm, the Boxy Charm box is uh, it's a monthly subscription box for makeup. It I don't spend as much makeup since I mean spend as much money as much money on makeup since I've had the subscription. Thirty five dollars for the premium box. I think it's forty nine for the luxe box and the base box is twenty five dollars, which you don't get when you get the luxe box. Everybody that don't know y'all, that's what I'm talking to. I know y'all know, you know, my everyday folks. I know y'all know. Ooh, this luxe box is hat. <laughs> to the getting feelings. Ooh! Still bubbles and glitz. And um, I know it don't matter. Oh, they took it off. They took the variation off and just put all of that right there. The variation ain't got no more. Okay. Well, let's see. The first thing I see. Oh, these are cute. Zaxi. These are the cute little earrings. Even though I never take mine out, I may one day wear these. These said Zaxi by Stephanie Taylor Cushion Cut Quartz or oh, Cubic Zirconia Halo Studs. It says these studs are $36. That's what they look like out of the package. Those are cute. Now I like those. I might take them out to wear these one day. I don't know how they would look. Just down there with these. I'm going, I like these. I'm going to definitely wear these. $36. And next thing I see on top, y'all, some more brushes. I am happy with December box. I 
can't counsel this. My girl, I tell you who it is. I ain't gonna put you on front street and say that. Told me she counseled the box it. I was hurt. I was so hurt for her. Because this is, I don't know. This is money I would be spending just because, you know, and then a lot of times the stuff I would have bought come in these boxes. Ooh, this is like velvet. I like this. This says Luxie Glitter and Gold Brush Set. A complete range from foundation, contouring, highlight to blending. It said this brush set is $85. Ooh. Now, I don't know about all that. But they got gold handles. And I really do like Luxie brushes. Let this be a, a not a highlight. Let it be thick enough for a blush. Ooh, it is. More so soft for highlight, but I can use it for a blush. And that's a wood handle. And I'm happy because I prefer the wood handles over the plastic handles. This is a bougie little brush set. Okay. I'm cool with that. I am cool with that. Happy, happy, happy. And the next, did I tell you how much that, that brush set was? Oh, $85. I did say it. I remember saying it now. The next thing I have in here is Juice Some Hot Mess. What is this? Hip, uh... What is this? I don't know what this is. Rocking Cosmetics Hot Mess Threesome Glitter Gel Pens. And what are they? Choose from one of these three intense shades. Blend all around the eye to create drama and sparkle. For the dance floor. Okay. This must be some something I need to Ooh, that's that. Let's open the green. Put aside for my daughter. That's what I was about to say. They super fat pencils. That's what the green looks like. Oh, that's cute. That's not a lot of glitter. Yeah, I got to do the most. Y'all know I do. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that finger. Ooh. Ooh. No, she can't have these. And that green is vibrant. Y'all see that? I like this. Uh-uh, she can't have these. I'm sorry, little bird. Mom got to keep these, honey. That's green. I got to open the other two. Okay, hold on. Okay, this is the blue one. Watch it right there. Oh, look at that blue. Okay. I like these. I almost did, girl. If I had not opened these, they would have right over in this bag of makeup I got from my daughter over here. I would have never seen it. Okay. And the last one is, oh, it's a black. That's what it looks like. I want to put that on my eyes. Y'all see that? And it's really black too. Now I don't know about the staying powder. Powder, if they stay, now nah, they smudge. But I like the colors. I like that green. That's cute. That's cute. Yeah, I'm keeping these. <laughs> okay, and these, uh, how much for these? Hot mess glitter pens. Well, forty dollars. Forty dollars for three. I'm gonna need them to stay. That little bit of glitter they got. Can y'all see it from back there? It's not a lot. But I'm going to need them to stay in place. I don't need them to smudge and move around. Because that ain't no good. Look around and have green stuff all under your eyes. Okay, the next thing I have here. I'm pretty sure that don't go there. Frank Body Glow Mask. It's caffeinated. Hmm. It's a moisturizing face mask. Uh, natural, ultra hydrating. It works to reduce puffiness and gives extra life and glow. It's perfect for pre-makeup, late nights, and mornings, and others. This is $21. Glow on, I dare you. <laughs> okay, it's got coffee in there. So I guess you put this on before you ready to do your makeup, and it wake you up and give you a little glow. I put that on the sink to give it a try. $21. Oh, really? Where is the box, though? And where the top? Oh, we got the top. Now, see, I don't care for this. What a box. And why did this come like this? This is the good jeans. 
and good jeans don't come like this y'all I don't know about this it's a it's a big box that it comes in and um I wanted to just take it out the box and put a sticker on it my top broke I don't know about this. I don't know. Y'all know what this is. This is Sunday Riley's Good Jeans. And it says it's $85. It's a lactate acid treatment. I don't know if I'm going to use this, y'all. I don't know. I don't know. It don't look like it's... It ain't closed up. But it looks like... And it smells like the Good Gene formula. Maybe they took it out of the box because of the price to make sure we wouldn't, you know, run around here trying to resell it or something. You know, people do that with these boxes, but I'd be too busy using my stuff. Okay, let's keep moving. The next thing here is Reza Be Obsessed. Love my leave-in. All for hair types. It's some kind of leave-in hairspray. Oh, it smells good. Smells good. Let me show it to y'all while I'm doing all the looking. It says, um, Reza Be Obsessed, Love My Leave-In. It says, it's formulated with golden fruit shield. This leave-in features seven ingredients. Champagne for high shine. Crushed diamonds for brilliance. Nourishing pea protein for strength. King coconut oil to fortify. Black truffle oil to moisture. And strawberry seed extract as an antioxidant. And it's $22. Leave in spray. This, this Lux box is okay. It's not fabulous, but it's okay. It's okay. And the last thing. Oh, it's two things in this box. It's two eyeshadow palettes, actually. This is a hip dot palette. And it says it's $30. I'm going to let y'all see what this looks like. I haven't heard a lot about hip dot cosmetics. That's what it looks like. And the palette. Oh, that's cute. These are the colors. I don't have a blue palette. So if the colors are as good as they look, I won't be mad at this either. Let me go with this blue. I'm going to go. Oh, they soft. Oh, they soft. Oh, look there. And this gold. Oh, let's watch it. I like it. <laughs> yeah, I like it. Yeah, that's another go stay with me. This is a hip dot palette eyeshadow. Uh, what's the name of this palette? Uh, C No Pressed Eyeshadow Palette. Unleash your inner goddess. Alluring blues and gleaming golds. It's a homage. Yeah, we know what C No is. Hundred dollars. Well, okay. This is hip dot. I'm cool with that. Okay, I got three palettes. How much was that palette? Uh, thirty dollars. And the last one, now I don't know about these iconic London palettes. This will be the second one that I didn't get out of a box of charm box. And the first one I just really didn't like. That's what it looks like. And it says, um, how much is this palette? Iconic London Blaze Chaser Face Palette. Of oh, it's a face palette featuring six shades of buttery velvet powders. It says it's fifty five dollars. I don't know. That's what it looks like. I don't know. I don't know that any of these shades will work for my um my skin tone. I'm gonna try this one. I know it's gonna be real pink. Hmm. Oh, it's cute. It's cute. Well, I almost lied, y'all. Let's see about this gold here. What will it do? If you do one, oh, I didn't. I I almost lied. That's a lot of highlight, but y'all know I'm just I'm just playing with it. Don't be so critical. I'm just playing with it. I know y'all. Yeah, it ain't on there, right? Let me do it right. Okay. All right, December. <laughs> Feel like getting late Christmas, late Christmas presents. Okay, that's it. That's it. I would pay $55 for that color, but uh, in boxing job, that's cool. That wasn't too bad. Uh, it, they could have ended the year with a bang. It was banging, but it wasn't like banging. It was good. It was good. Okay, and the last box here is the box of stuff that I don't remember, but I did order it from uh, the Boxy Pop-Up in December. I don't never get much from them because usually it's something that I could have gotten in the box, but let's see what I did. Oh, I remember now. 
I remember getting this because I like these brushes. These are the uh told you I got a thing for brushes, but this is my this brush here is my favorite concealer brush. But these are brushes from um what is the name of this? Um uh, yeah. Ooh, I dropped it. What is this? Uh Alamore. Alamore Cosmetics. That's what it is. I like that line. I like their products. And this, like I said, this is my favorite brush for my brows and putting my concealer on. So I'm happy to have them. I got one set earlier this year. Probably what was in February? Last year. February, March in a box. And when I saw them on there, I was like, I got to get them. Got to get them. Uh, the next thing I got in here is Brazilian Kiss Tinted Capucha Lip Balm. I'm going to put this in my purse. I just wanted it because I would have got it on Sephora. When it first came out, I was like, nah, I'm going to hold off. Oh, that's cute. That is so cute. It's like a small bum bum spray. Oh, I hope this is a clear bum. Oh, and it is. And it is. It just got a little shimmer. It's right there. See, so you can't even see it. Yeah, this is going in my purse. Yes. Can't put on lipsticks now. So, this is going to be perfect. I don't know what that smell like. It smell like, okay, capucha, I guess. It smell like cappuccino, but not really cappuccino. Yeah, I'll need the box. Um, the next thing I got here is, oh, I like this. Now, I do like this. I purchased this twice. Let me show y'all. When I saw that on there, I was like, yes, give me that. This is the Milk Makeup Face Powder. And I think I got translucent again. Yeah, translucent deep. And this one is, uh, Translucent medium. I wanted to get the deep for all over. I know where I got this. And I did need to be getting another powder. But this was like $37. $12 in a box of pop-up. Yes. That's what the deep look like. For all over. If you can tell compared to the light. Yeah. Yes. Yes. I'm happy to have it back. Blur. Set. And go. <laughs> yes. $12. Man. And I'm telling you, I have to get this apart. I, I don't know what y'all think. And if y'all ain't on, you know, I don't always get from Boxy Pop Up, but when they have the good stuff that I know is good, I have to get it. This is the main reason I ordered from Pop Up and for these palettes. Because I think it was Jackie I and I seen do a review. Oh, uh, yeah, OPV Beauty. And I was like, oh, that palette looks lit. Let me order it. I never did. And I saw that, I remembered the name. When it popped up and pop up, I was like, yeah, man, let me grab that. Because those shadows came off so good. Let's see. I, I don't know if it was this palette. I don't remember what palette it was. But this is the Spotlight palette. That she reviewed, I'm saying. But I knew I wanted to get one of their palettes. Ooh, yeah. Look at them colors. Look at that. None of this stuff was what nine or twelve dollars, something like that. It was not expensive at all. So, yes, give it to me. I will take it. I will take it. I gotta stop by makeup, y'all. It's taking over, or I gotta start getting rid of more stuff. And the next thing I got here is OPV the Born to Shine Blush Palette. I knew if I got the eyeshadow palette, I had to have blush. And the only blush palette, y'all, I got. I'm going to and keep it 100 with y'all because we, we family. You know, we like this. We, we have these kind of discussions. You know, is this old MAC palette that's got all these blushes. This is the only blush palette I have. But I, I still love it. But it's really old, but I really still love it. And um, I ain't going to get rid of it. I'm just going to keep using it when I get ready to use it. <laughs> so when I saw this, I was like, let me just get me. A blush palette that ain't you know I ain't gonna pay no no uh six to seven dollars for no blush it ain't it ain't necessary it ain't required and a lot of my uh Jewfish Place palettes a lot of those shades and those palettes work awesome for blushes too so for the price I really got an official blush palette now try get it open y'all Bam, born to shine. OPV London. Oh, shoots. I don't know if 
I did. I thought that the shades would be dark. But see, that's why I wanted to get it. That's, I'm glad I did get it because I got a lot of blushes and all of them dark blushes. I want, let me see. Let's see about this shimmer one. Let's see about this right here. I'm going to put it on top of the other blush, y'all. Okay, I don't see that. Let's see about this mauve. Oh, yeah. Okay, it's going to work. <laughs> this going to work. It's going to let me mess up and put on too much blush like I always do, like I love to do. So, I mad. Well, let me tone this down a little bit. <laughs> pink on top of pink. So, y'all going to know what happened. Y'all going to know. Oh, look at that orange. I should have did that orange. But I'm going to swatch it because I'd be doing too much to put that on. Oh, and it's orange. Put it right here. Okay, it ain't too orange. It's orange, but it ain't too orange. So y'all gonna know what's up when y'all see me real blushy. It was this palette. Okay, y'all. I don't remember how much it was. But I know it was like nine or twelve dollars. I didn't go over that amount, much of an amount. So that is all of these boxes, y'all. The last one we got is my Sips by T, my uh skincare box and my Lush Beauty box and I will try to get them up for y'all as soon as possible. Then we're going to have to wing it on video because that ain't what I know how to talk about it today. I love y'all. Y'all stay blessed and I will see you guys in the next Bye guys.